Okay guys, so we just made it to the flea market. We're also trying out a new mic system. So feel free to let me know how you like it, how it sounds. Henry's gonna go pay and then we're gonna go inside. A lot of stuff out here today. Looking at her. <laughs> I'll be that there for you. The heating. Hey, you know it's Wednesday, it's coming up. You come out with dogs. Yeah, I'm yeah. yeah. A little bear. Mm -hmm. That's crazy. I've never seen people sell puppies here, and today we've seen two. The boxers and then these. They're cute. But where do I put them? Yeah, it is. It's spring. It's like birth season. Birth season. So this flea market that we're at has two sections. This part where we're at right now, it's kind of like a thrift store style where it's like people have like lightly used stuff and then they're reselling it, which I kind of like because you can get like a good discount on stuff. And then the other side is like the more newer stuff, you know, which where they have like the lashes and, you know, things like that. All right, guys. So I just made my first purchase of the day and it's actually a litter box for my kitties. It was such a good deal though. It was five bucks. Dude, those are normally like 20 plus dollars. So still, if you ask me, we're just looking around this section right now. Okay, so now we're entering the spa on the mascotas like nuevas. It's like it's a dollar fifty the jewelry. Look at these things. ¿A cuánto tiene este? Este es de 15. I felt so much pressure in that little stand. I felt so much pressure in that little stand. The guy ran up and he's like, what do you want? And I was like, uh, I'm just looking at him. He's like, let me get the bag. And I was like, mm. No, sir. I need some time. Guys, so we are back. <laughs> Look at my Senora Life part. All the Senoras be having these at the flea market. But anyway, so let me show you guys what I bought real quick. It wasn't too much because it was so hot, you guys. Like, super, super hot. And I just, we couldn't take it. It was, like, too hot. Anyways, I got the litter box that I showed you guys. It's this one. I like it because it's tall and it's covered. And it has vent holes. And then I got a yoga mat. I got this one for $10. I really like it because it's, like, pretty thick. And then it has this little strap that you can just hold it and go wherever you need to go. And then for a dollar, a dollar in like the um, like thrift store section of the flea market, we got this. I don't know what this is. It's like a bed side table, like a bed table, like if you want to eat in your bed. These are like usually run for way more. And I'm so excited that we found this. Obviously, I just need to like clean it up a bit, but. I thought that was a great deal. And then what else did I get? Oh, let me show you. Okay, and then last but not least, I love getting either lashes because, you know, those don't expire and they're brand new at the flea market or I like getting hair treatment. I always do check the expiration date because you never know with the flea market. It could be a hit or miss. I bought stuff that is expired at times and I just have to throw away. But now I check. Okay, so these two... I got these are the it's a 10 you guys these are really pricey okay normally these are really pricey i got them for seven dollars each i got this one this one both leave-in conditioners and then i got the it's my clothes this one's a little beat up oops it looks a little beat up but it's the blonde version and it's still pretty good very excited about this can't wait to use it i got two of the paul mitchell oils again everything was like a little bit dirty but they were for seven dollars you guys this is a really good price let me see quanto they see i don't know how much these are usually but i'll go ahead and leave the price here somewhere but i think this is a good deal for seven dollars so i was so excited and i had to get both of them because i'm always looking for hair oils as you guys know especially like at marshall cj max stores like that and it's been so hard to find them lately so i'm glad i found these i'll see you guys we did not buy any snacks at the flea market i know like snacks at the flea are like a big deal like the los tilocos, the drinks, the chips, 
like the agua fresca, you know, all those good stuff, the tacos. Like, oh my god, I'm, I'm from Sombra, girl. I am. I, it was a hot day. It was a hot day. Okay. Well, anyways, we didn't buy any of that because we are on a diet. Me and my fiance, we are both calorie counting currently. It has been quite a learning experience because. It just puts things into perspective, but we are trying hard, you guys. Let me stop rambling. I'll see you guys mañana to see what the adventure is for tomorrow, girl. I am like tan AF. Okay. Okay, so we have quite a bit of stuff. I can't wait to show you guys what we got when we get home. So much good deals. Right now, we're pretty much done. I just want to go get some cacahuates with chile because they're so good from here. And I also kind of want to get a papaya. I like papayas. Let me go there. But we got a lot of stuff, kids. A lot of stuff. I'll see you guys. We had an issue with the audio earlier with my mic where I recorded, but all um, there's no audio for any of that, so <gasps> you will not be seeing that footage. But let's go to the fruta and get some stuff. My last one. from over there somewhere and then we couldn't find them anymore mm -hmm. and then we found these and now we can't find them it sucks now you're if it's the same people or they just move around yeah <laughs> alright guys so we are back from the food market we had a bit of technical difficulties over there with audio situations but anyways we are back and I'm going to show you guys the haul because we got we found so many good finds over there. So how this flea market works is like they have a section where there's like newer stuff, packaged stuff. And then in the back, they have a section where it's more like thrift store vibe stuff where you can, it's been lightly used and you can probably bargain a little bit more. So we tend to go to that side over there just because I feel like there's always good finds that people just don't want anymore. It's like a Mexican thrift market. Okay, so let's go ahead and start. Okay, first thing I'm gonna start with, just so I can get it out of the way and I'm not scared to break it, is this beer stein right here. I'll go ahead and put the prices on the side just so you know how much they were. We've got this beer stein. These normally run for like over a hundred dollars. It's, it's in pretty good condition. This is what it looks like. Super cute. We got this for my fiance so i'm gonna go ahead and put this aside so next up and as you guys saw i did get this booty band these you guys are also do run pricey it's pretty sturdy and i got this one for two dollars and it was brand new in the little packaging right here so i'm super happy about that because girl summer is right around the corner and we need to get this booty looking thick okay so that's that one Okay, guys, and then we went to, uh, like I said, we spent most of our time in, like, the thrift store section part, and I got this. Now, originally, this is a bunch of brushes, by the way. I should get scissors to cut this one. Moment, please. So, I got these face brushes. I'm going to wash them, of course. Guys, originally, the man was, like, $30, and I was like, oh. I was like, oh, absolutely not, but it's $30. Anyways, I talked them down to $15, but it's a bunch of brushes. Let's see what we got because I don't even know what we got. First of all, you guys, 15 for all this is a really good deal. Um, they have one of these brushes right here that is to dye your hair. Feels good quality. They have a Japanese brush, which automatically makes this whole thing like worth it. Japanese is a really good brand and it's really expensive and it feels like it's really good quality. It feels like this one is also in really good conditions. I'm not going to go through all of them, obviously, but I'll show you guys some of the big brands that I see. This one, I don't know what it is, but it looks kind of real techniques-ish to me. True Beauty. It Cosmetics. Girl. I think there's another Japanese brush. We got some e.l.f. brushes here. 
what is this i don't know what this one is but it reminds me of like the sephora style brushes it could be another elf one a kabuki brush i don't know where this is from but a kabuki brush we got a morphe brush another elf one which i actually own two of these particular ones for the foundation these work so good you guys if you guys haven't tried them get your one equal tools i am gonna wash all of these and they look like they're in pretty good condition too so much good stuff you guys this is definitely worth well over and there's more like this was definitely worth well over $15. I am very happy with this purchase right here. Of course, I'm going to brush them. Of course, I'm going to wash them. But this was definitely a really, really great find. So I'm super happy about that. Next up, you guys, I won't show it on camera because I feel like YouTube is being a little funny with that kind of stuff. But this is a like chopper and knife. I'll put a picture of it. I don't think they'll mind me putting a picture of it. But I think they'll mind if I show it. So I won't be showing. So I also got these measuring spoons and it comes with the little level so you can level it off. And fun thing about these is that they're magnetic steel. So I got these and then I got the, what is it, cleaver knife? A meat cleaver knife. And then this whole bag, you guys, is full of tiny little food. Like, we got this for my little niece. She's going to love it. Her sister is actually... A waitress like they just want to be like their older siblings and it's so cute so she's been playing um waitress so she has her own little notebook and she writes down her little recipes and it's so cute and she has such a good imagination that she'll like play play pretend with all like any random household item that it's food which is so cute but i'm so happy that she's gonna have her little comidita now and she's been telling me that she's updated her little restaurant so i think she's gonna love this i'm so excited to give it to her and actually fun fact you guys the man that was selling this gave it to us for free well he was giving it to us for free but i i paid him five dollars because i was like no sir <laughs> tampoco like let's let's not steal from them and then so there's a bunch of stuff in here there's like little sauces there's like little donuts like a little french fries there the ketchup it's so cute everything's super cute i think she's gonna love it and then i also got this fan it says mine 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 <laughs> how cute as you guys know i do like going to rave so i can't wait to take this one i feel like it's gonna be a vibe everybody's gonna i feel like everybody's gonna say mine everywhere because why not so this is super cute i am so glad we got this one and then i also just got a mascara from that stand also this is a brown mascara i heard that brown mascaras are they look more natural so we'll see how this works out okay so next up i got this fashion over dress tagged brand new it's really pretty i love this kind of stuff i feel like it's really classy to me so i really really like it and i'm so happy i found it guess how much i paid for it the tag says it's originally 32 dollars i paid four dollars for this four dollars a brand new it feels amazing i'm so excited i can't wait to wear that and then since summer's coming up i do like wearing rompers during the summer so i got this one now i don't really like wearing flowers but it was there and it was cute so i was like let me just let me just get it this one was also four dollars it looks like this really cute in between spring summer vibes and then i got this one because it kind of gave me like wedding vibes even though it's just white and it's like lace and it's really pretty too super cute this one was i think five dollars but still a good price for the little romper and then from that same stand, um, this one was $5. I got a cropped, also tagged brand new. I didn't even think this one was brand new, actually. I got a cropped denim jacket. So cute. Oh my god, dude. Ni me va a quedar. <laughs> well, actually, it might, it might, it might, it might, it might. Okay, but this is what it looks like. It's cropped. She's cute. I like it. I really do like it. Okay. So that's all the clothing items I got. And then we got these two little uh we got these two little toys because they have like little Mario thing. We kind of want to DIY something with these. So stay tuned, maybe I'll show you guys. But this is what they look like. So cute. I love toad, you guys. Fun fact. And I didn't even know there was a pink toad. And she has like little braids. So cute. Last but not least, I got this Junie and Berg bag. It's more vintage style but it's so cute i really do like it this is more of a timeless style if you will 
this is so cute and guess how much i got this for you guys five dollars you know how much it's usually retail for like 200 maybe so cute look at it se abra si i like it it has like the chunky zipper the leather feels nice it's in really good quality i like it i really do like it and then i also got the papaya but it's over there in my kitchen and i just don't want to bring it over here but i think we got some really good finds for really good prices and i am very happy about that the only thing i'm not happy about is that my vlog footage is lost but that's okay we can try again next time you guys want to come with me next time to the flea market we can go again next time and then we'll see what else we buy so i will insert the very little that we got it was still fun so go ahead and watch that thank you guys so much for coming along with me to the flea market we had a little bit of ups and downs but it was fun overall it was super hot but we got some good deals and i'm excited to like wash everything and use everything I just love it, you guys. I 